look at me. I was in politics. I led the largest, uh, oldest political party in my state. I was president of the Congress party. But there were certain contradictions in my belief and what my party was doing at that time. I left the party. I started something on my own. And today, I'm extremely proud that my Kitra Motha, which is the Kitra Indigenous Nation Progressive Alliance, my party, today is not an offshoot of Congress. It's much bigger than the party in the left. Why? Because I went back to the family. I went back to my people. I went back to my community. And I said, you know what? It may be a difficult over there, but let's give it a shot. And today, being invited here in Oxford, I feel honored, I feel humble, but more importantly, I can go back to my state and talk to my people, Bengalis, Chinese, Hindus, <coughs> Muslims, Christians, Buddhists, my Tikrasa people, and I can tell them that you know what? At least people have started hearing who we are. The conversation has to start when the high and mighty start listening to the smallest ill in the society. And that is the true democracy that I believe. You did, you showed me your institute's work, and you said that at times it's challenging. What is life without challenge? Today, I can proudly say that standing here, when I go back to my country, I will challenge the high and mighty. Because what is the most important thing in life? Some people say money, some people say fame. You know what I figured? I have money. I have fame. I guess I still have fame. But you know what is one thing which I desire the most? It's called credibility. It's called commitment. It's called a drive to prove something, a legacy. And that can only happen. When you go to a village like Mandai, Alai, you would know this word, Sanchanpur, Sanpur, Ambasa, Takajala, these are small villages, small areas in our part of the Travis House where our indigenous people live. And when you go there and you see an old woman who's got nothing, who earns less than a pound a week, come out and give some rice for us to eat. Not because we don't have enough, but it's out of the love. When the expectation comes, then you ask yourself, Pradyo, you may be the son of the last king of Zipra, but you don't want to remain the son of the last king of Zipra on the day you die. You give something back to your people. How do you do it? You do it with honesty. You do it with commitment. And you do it by spreading the word of our people. 